Steve, honor guests, ladies and gentlemen, good morning. Uh, thank you for inviting me to join you at this symposium. We are here to explore the power of Internet of Things, in particular, the opportunities and development for the electronics industry in Hong Kong. As we are heading towards the future of connectivity, IoT has received tremendous attention over the past few years. The potential for IoT to create economic impact is huge. According to a report by the McKinsey Global Institute in June 2015, titled The Internet of Things, Mapping the Value Beyond the Hype, it is estimated that IoT has a total potential economic impact of about US $4 trillion to US $11 trillion by 2025. In Hong Kong, to promote the development of industries and re-industrialization, IoT is also among the key areas of development included in the recent policy address of the Hong Kong SAR government. Indeed, IoT is opening up new opportunities to innovate products and services and to increase the efficiency of operations. IoT is fundamentally changing business models. It creates new value for industries and our industry players are and should be interested in capturing the new opportunities as we saw earlier from the tour of the uh, projects uh, demonstrated in the showcase uh, just outside uh, this uh, lecture hall. And to add to the cartoon that you saw displayed by Steve earlier, i just like to add another device because recently I have the personal experience of doing slow coke. <laughs> I find it difficult to go home at 4 p.m. to start cooking <laughs> so that what I want to serve my guests would be ready by 7 p.m. Of course, luckily, the device I'm using, there's actually a hi-fi version. I can actually control it from my office if I want to. So in the future, maybe I can invite my friends over to my place and try my Internet of Things assisted slow cook. Okay. <laughs> to make the best use of the opportunities and possibilities from IoT, today's symposium has provided a good platform for industries to have a further understanding of the latest trend and knowledge. I think that universities will also have a role to play in advancing the technology in support of the industries. At the Hong Kong Polytechnic University, we have a variety of research relevant to the three major areas to be explored in this symposium. Of course, those major areas are smart logistics, smart home, and smart city. To share with you just two examples, in recent years, we have established the Research Institute for Sustainable Urban Development and the University Government Industry Consortium for Sustainable Urban, Urban Development. And one of the key areas in the study and research is indeed on smart cities. Later this year, our university will set up a university research facility in big data analytics, which is closely associated with IoT. This center will facilitate joint research within the university and collaborations with the industries. I certainly want to take this opportunity to extend my invitation to our industry partners to come join with our researchers 
to conduct joint research when this facility opens later this year. IoT technologies and applications will be central to our future development. In fact, innovations are making great impact on the social and economic development of our city, our country, and indeed the whole world. In this regard, PolyU is partnering with Times Higher Education to host the Times Higher Education Innovation and Impact Summit next week on June 1st and 2nd, and it will be held at Hotel Icon. I welcome you to come to participate, especially our out-of-town guests. If you are still in Hong Kong, I certainly welcome you to come join the summit. This summit is offered as uh, part of the celebration of PolyU's 80th anniversary. And we use a theme, Opening Minds, Shaping the Future for our anniversary celebration. And I believe your discussions today on IoT will help shape a connected future. And you are welcome to join us uh, next week on June 1st and 2nd at Hotel Icon. So once again, let me thank the Federation of Hong Kong Industries and Hong Kong Electronics Industry Council for inviting me to join this symposium. I wish you a very, very fruitful discussions. Thank you very much.